meteorologist Sarah Gannon. Well, it was an absolutely gorgeous day out there today, and we even saw a nice little gift there of a little bit of rainfall. Unfortunately, not really seeing many totals amounting to anything here, so that's kind of the bad news, but we'll take any little bit of rainfall that we can get. Hey, this temperature is not too bad today. Cooler than average. We're typically in the low 70s, but today we've been hanging out in those upper 60s, low 70s. So 70 degrees still in Charles City and Mason City, 65 right now in Rochester, 66 in Austin and Albert Lee. But beautiful sunshine out there as we check in with your Lewis Donald live camera network. Nothing but blue skies, few clouds out there, but hey, uh, pretty decent conditions to get outside. So all that rain activity that we did see earlier today now well off to our east and to our south. So we've got clear skies overhead and just a few of those clouds lingering around. So as we time the, as we look a little bit further out, you'll notice more of that activity stretching throughout parts of Wisconsin and a little further to our south towards the Des Moines area. That's all along a cold front kind of driving it in that direction. So high pressure will now gradually take control of the upper Midwest and that will keep us in a pretty quiet and comfortable pattern here for the next couple of days. Tonight we will be on the clear side with that sky coverage, but we are expected to be a bit on the chilly side for tonight. Temperatures looking to cool back towards those low 40s. So a little crisp as we start off your Wednesday morning. Rain chances, however, for the upcoming week. I know we enjoy that a little bit today. We'll continue to stay limited. Next best chance arrives on Friday, but we are going to look forward to 70s returning back to the region. So as we time things out or track things out, I should say with our temperature trend, you'll notice that Wednesday is still a little bit below average. So we'll see high temperatures tomorrow into those mid upper 70s. Then we'll take a little quick jump there towards those mid 70s on Thursday. We'll see a nice good push there of some warm air back into the region, but we'll gradually cool towards those low 70s as we head towards Friday and into the weekend. So that will be a bit more seasonal for the area. We're typically anywhere from around 72 to 73 degrees this time of the year for those highs. So timing things out for the rest of tonight. We'll look to see Scott clear skies overhead future track. I think maybe a little bit cooler here with those overnight temperatures indicating maybe some upper 30s possible in some isolated locations, but I think area wide low 40s looking really, really likely for our area. So we'll look to see partly sunny skies on the way for tomorrow. High temperatures only staying into those 60s. So another cooler day is expected, but as we head towards Thursday, notice those winds shifting now coming out of the south. That's really going to push in more of that warm air and allow those temperatures to climb towards those mid and upper 70s. So as I mentioned with that rainfall, again, staying very limited for our area. Here's a look at how things will track out. But Friday looking to be our next best opportunity as a cold front passes through. But overall looking to stay pretty isolated in manner. So not expecting a big washout event. We'll certainly take one of those, just not in the cards this week. As for tonight, we'll see temperatures cooling back towards those low 40s. We'll be on the chilly side for tonight. Looking to see partly sunny skies on the way for your Wednesday with high temperatures a little bit below average still into those mid 60s. Here's a look at your garden gallery winner for this evening. Kathy with a beautiful sunflower from Rochester. Congratulations, Kathy. You can head on down to Sergeant's on second here in town and claim your prize. Here's a look at today's seven day forecast looking at partly sunny skies for Wednesday. More sunshine on the way for Thursday as highs climb to those mid 70s. Isolated rain showers on the way for Friday, but check out that weekend forecast. Pretty awesome there. Low 70s, some nice sunshine. Nick.